This is a small tutorial on how to create a cute teddy bear like this in Photoshop. We will be starting from scratch and creating the character. We will be taking two uh, circles and then we will be roughly drawing the sketch. Now we have a rough sketch of the character we are going to build. We are keeping the head of the teddy bear bigger and body small. This will be in proportion to the figures of babies who have their head bigger and body small. That will make the character look more cute. So this is just a line drawing, we are drawing in a layer. Now we are adjusting the body uh, positions. Now we will make a group and keep this in a layer separately. Now we will start the coloring, we will take the grass brush and then in the shape properties we are going to change the angle jitter to 100%, roundness jitter to around 6% and we will be increasing the maximum diameter slightly. For scattering we are keeping the count as 4. In the color dynamics panel we are going to keep the slider from background to 41 color to 100%. We are going to unclick the transfer button. We will take the foreground color a little uh, lighter brown and the background color a little darker brown. That way this brush will give this furry painting feel. We have changed the line opacity to about 10% so that it can act as a guide. Now we will start coloring. Now I am going to speed up the process. Now we are keeping the mouth in a separate layer because we will be animating that. Now we are drawing the ears, now we will draw one ear then we will duplicate it and put it on the other side. We, we are taking the light source from left to right so the top right part of all the body parts will be a little lighter and the down right portion will be a little darker. Now we are doing the body in a separate layer. Since we are going to animate the character, we need all the body parts in different layers. Change the foreground and background color of the brush to get this lighter and darker feel. Now we are 
drawing the hand, we will, we will again draw one hand and then we will copy and duplicate this hand and put it on the other side. Similarly for the leg, we are going to draw one leg and then duplicate and flip the leg and put it on the other side. We have to complete the whole leg that is not seen in the picture because we will be animating the character so while walking or moving the legs some odd parts doesn't come out. Now we are going to make the eyes. To make the areas lighter, we are going to use the dodge tool. To make the areas darker, we are going to use the burn tool. So now we will be giving all the shades. These shades will add volume to the character, so it will look more uh, 3D like. So we are doing the finishing touches and our character is almost ready. We have all the different parts of the character in different layers so that we can easily animate them. So our character is ready. Thank you for watching.